Saints lose the puck. Wilcox goes after it. Dellenbach misses him. Jarvis is out in front and he scores. Jarvis, a two on one on the rush. Dellenbach missed the check. Fakasi couldn't get back on Jarvis. And he gets his third goal in three games. Colt dives to try to take it away. He can't. Toby gets it down the ice, knocked out of midair by Ebert before it can get to Jarvis. Colt gets it to center ice from Fracassi. He walks in, takes a shot, and he scores! Max Culp with a dart from the blue line, and he goes past Lowry. That's one he'll want to get back after we just talked about how composed he looked in net. And the Saints tie the game on the power play, one to one. Down deep, Culp gets to it first. Culp deeks away from a man. He has Ebert walking in for the point. Ebert takes a slap shot and he scores! Ebert wired one, short-handed, and the Saints have a two to one lead. A shorty is always a momentum changer. There is no doubt about that. And that was all set up by Culp's play just prior to the faceoff. That is exactly what this team needs. Let's see how they play with the lead. He gets it off the wall, too far for Culp. Musfelt buries Livingston at center ice. What a hit by A.J. Musfelt. And now in over the line is Wilcox. Wilcox going for the poke check, he scores! Wilcox beat the poke check of Steve Salick. He came out with that. Wilcox dodged to the side and put it over the sprawling Salick. And this game is tied 2-2. Two to two. Now Wilcox has a break again. Wilcox to the outside. Engdahl keeps it away. Wilcox scores one-handed. What a goal by Keith Wilcox. And they take the lead shorthanded with 24 seconds remaining in the penalty. It's flipped out through center. Dellenbach can't knock it down. Fracassi takes it. Sharkey can't take the puck back. It's out in front. Bus gets rocked by Dellenbach. Catching him on the side and taking him down as Godfrey gets through center. He, like you said, he had it right on the doorstep, a wide open look at it and just could not finish, gripping the stick a bit too tight. Mitch has the stick, now he shoots, he scores! Mitch walks into the shot and he ties the game. Central Wisconsin, three to three. Beautiful play there by Mike Mitch. Just a veteran being in position. We've got a whole new game. Culp kicks it to his stick, gets it across to Ebert. Ebert can't handle the pass, but it's a two on two with Van Houter. Ebert walks in, takes a slap shot, he scores! Jeremy Ebert with 52 seconds remaining, scores top shelf where Mama hides the cookies and the Saints lead four to three. Ebert takes it, he gets it off the wall. Culp one on one now, Culp on Cobb. Culp goes to the outside, Culp shoots, he scores! Max Culp seals the victory with his second goal of the game just 10 seconds after the marker put up by Ebert. Great individual effort by Max Culp and the Saints lead 5-3. to three. Culp and Ebert have done so much for the Saints all season long and really coming to fruition on the score sheet here today. Just a beautiful performance by both of those guys. A good team effort by the Saints and they should be cruising to a victory now. You give up two goals in 43 seconds, you're in a world of hurt.